As soon as I've finished here, Archibald, I'm nearly done. Mm. Hello? Archduke here. Oh, dear. I'm still waiting for that automatic watering system that you promised me for today. Yes, well, it's not quite ready. I expect you at the town hall immediately. Hurry up, my vegetables are thirsty. Oh, good grief. I'll never have enough time to do all that in a day. Oh, no, Archibald! I feel like a sausage. Something's wrong here. Yeah? Uh, Edison, finally. Where's the machine? I haven't finished it. What? Well, what are you waiting for? Listen, Archduke, you must give Edison enough time to finish his inventions in order to avoid disasters. Believe me, I know what I'm talking about. I'll bring it to you tomorrow morning. Fine, fine. Now, there's a committee meeting at nine o'clock tomorrow morning. You can bring it then. Oh, dear. It's late. I'm not going to have time to go and see Sullivan. Sometimes time flies, and sometimes it doesn't. See you tomorrow, Edison. He's right. Time does fly. Unless... <laughs> going to be the greatest invention of all time! <laughs> oh. Ooh. There. All I need to do now is put the clock back where it belongs. Not seen or heard. And now, the moment of truth. <laughs> It works! I can change time! I can even stop it! <laughs> Wake up, incredible inventor! It's nearly nine o'clock! Wake up, incredible inventor! Oh! Oh dear! I'm late! Think about it. I've all the time in the world. <laughs> what are we waiting for? He's got five minutes, not a moment longer. I haven't got time to wait. I've got pans on the stove. The children are waiting for their lessons. If this continues, I'm going to have to go fishing without having my siesta. Ah, here he is. Morning, everybody. This really is too much. Edison, the meeting was supposed to start at nine o'clock. It is nine o'clock. Check the town hall clock. Oh. Uh, uh, yes, well, you're absolutely right, Edison. Um, we must have all been early. Hmm. I don't believe it. I'm stunned. Well, I'm never. I can't believe it. Archibald, uh, sometimes time flies. And sometimes it doesn't. My dear Archduke, here is my new invention I promised you. <laughs> Edison, when are you going to come to the print shop? I can come right away if you like. Impossible. I haven't got a minute until three o'clock this afternoon. In that case, I'll see you at three. <laughs> so silly to have to wait hours to improve Sullivan's press. And this. There. No more wasted time. Good afternoon, Archibald. 
good afternoon. But the day's only just begun. Oh, la la. I don't believe it. Three o'clock in the afternoon already, and not a single customer. What a day. Hello again, Souffle. But what are you doing? I'm tidying up. It's time to close. What? But it's only... Three o'clock in the afternoon. Did you not hear the town hall clock? Well, I never. How strange. Uh, I haven't even finished preparing lunch. And it's time to start thinking about dinner. What a day. Doing here, listen. I'm not expecting you to three o'clock. But it's gone three o'clock, my dear Sullivan. You're joking. Check if you don't believe me. Oh. Oh, this is a disaster. The day is, is nearly over. Calm down, Sullivan. Take your time. I've got to print the newspaper for tomorrow morning, and I haven't got a single article. <laughs> oh. oh dear. Oh dear. Huh? Oh, oh, whoa. Oh. Oh. Hello, John Dory. What's happened? I was supposed to go fishing this morning, but it's already the afternoon. Oh, oh. Hmm. Don't worry, Iris. John Dory's just gone fishing. You'll get your fish this evening. This evening? Yes. It's after three o'clock already. What? Archibald, oh. I need an article. Are you on a case that I can tell my readers about? Um, no. I've got to print the newspaper tonight, and I haven't written a word. You don't normally leave everything to the last minute. I didn't notice time fly by. Time is definitely passing too quickly at the moment. Hey, hey, what about my article? Ba ba ba. I'm sure you're worrying about nothing, Archibald. Everybody, especially me, is very busy, and we don't notice the time flying by, that's all. That may be so, Archduke, but what if the town hall clock was wrong? That's absolutely impossible, Archibald. That clock has always told the right time. It has never been wrong, even by a second. Right, right. I'd better get my watch fixed, then. Ah, uh, Archibald, uh, could you take mine, too? I think it's broken. There. It took a long time, but Sullivan's press is now working to full capacity. I could do with a rest. And as I don't want to be disturbed... No sooner said than done. Edison! Edison, I need you! I haven't got the time. Look, the day's finished. Finished? It can't be. This time, I want it to be absolutely clear. The key to the mystery is in here, I'm sure. Well, well, well. Someone's been up here recently. But if the clock works so well, oh, what could this be? <laughs> Not a chance. It's welded on. who wanted to take my time and all these watches that need to be put to the right time. What a job! I don't even know what the right time is anymore. <laughs> Open up! It's Archibald. Oh. I need to talk to you. Oh, Archibald, do you by any chance know what time it is? No, but I'm sure you're about to take great pleasure in telling me. Alas, I am unable. Someone has tampered with the town hall clock and has changed the time. <gasps> How strange. It looks exactly like the town hall clock. Oh, no, Archibald, don't touch that. It's already complicated enough as it is. Oh, really? Why is that? I can change the time on the town hall clock as I wish with this miniature watch. I wanted to make time faster or slower, you see. To have more time. Well, my poor Edison, this is a fiasco. We need to get everything back to its proper time. But that's the problem. By constantly changing the time on the island, I have no idea what the real time is. Have no fear. Archibald is here. 
The Earth turns on itself and around the Sun. Do you understand, Archibald? Yes. Right. How long do you think the Earth takes to spin on itself? A day and a night. So, 24 hours. Right answer, Archibald. At the position of the Sun, we know what time it is. But of course! What's more, here's a sundial which will tell you the exact time. According to the sun, it's midday. That's it. Thank you, Miss Julie. I think it's about time that time is put straight. Dear friends, I am sure that you have noticed that the 